This is, without doubt, the coolest bootcamp venue ever. Alright, so we're in London for the ALGS Major. Uh, it's the first tournament of the year for Apex Legends. We obviously won the season, and this is basically what it like uh, culminates to: is that all the international, the best international teams from around the world, like the top 40, all come here to London. The boys are here three days early to boot camp, and I am pumped to have secured them the Red Bull Gaming Sphere for them to boot camp at. It's actually the sickest thing ever. Like we have Red Bulls on tap. Fridges that we can just take drinks from whenever we want. We have personal setups. We just literally have anything we want and we have this entire venue to ourselves. It's absolutely incredible. So I'm here for the week doing social content, filming a couple of partnership deliverables, taking photos of the players, watching us win. It's gonna be sick. So I'm buzzing for this week. So yeah, let's get this bread and let's get this dub. I felt like Sherlock Holmes earlier when you like went around the corner and you just disappeared. <laughs> that was fun. I didn't know where you were though. Raven, how was your first meal in London? Feeling good. Delicious. Mwah. I just found out though that my brother is in London this week, which is dope. He works in the video and film industry in London, does the camera work for like films. He worked on Doctor Strange, the Fast and Furious series, he's done James Bond, Star Wars. Yeah, it's sick. I would say I have to go to the supermarket today to get a bunch of British snacks. I've got a list of like crisps, drinks, like fizzy drinks and like candy that I'm gonna get the guys to try. That's probably tomorrow. Um, but I need to go to the supermarket and kind of like get it all. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. I'm excited to see their reaction to things. Hey, buddy. Alright, so it's 7th day, I'm out of Shoreditch, I'm trying to find some breakfast, I couldn't be bothered to wait for everybody else. My goal is basically just to go and find like a coffee shop which I can work in, have some breakfast. I'm pretty proud of getting us this venue. Basically, I have a couple of like people that I know and that work at Red Bull, so I was able to like secure us the venue for the three days. And I'm looking at like other teams who are at other venues getting like packet loss and like cramped in with 10 other teams. So I definitely think uh, I'm pretty proud of being able to like contribute to hopefully their success this weekend. Let's see. Did you eat beans on toast this morning? I did. What did you think of it? No. Why not? It's a texture. Is the texture is weird? I don't like you. I just I had a I had a whole like the whole bean on the toast, and I tried it that way. It was weird. So I was like, all right, what if I smoosh the bean Ugh. on the toast, like avocado, and, I, and then I tried it that way, and it still didn't work. <laughs> I was like, nope. Ninety and one. I got a swap. Sear one dead. Winnable. Remember, Sear in this building has it. That's Kraber. Dude, we just just fucking look at. He's looking for a headshot on me. All in the big door. Sear 110. 110 on Sear. All right, scrims done. We smurf the absolute crap out of set two. How do you uh, how do you feel set two went today? A lot better than set one. That's for yeah. sure. We needed a little bit of uh, time to warm up. Now I'm feeling good. The boys are feeling good. Yeah, I'm excited to see them actually play now. We're going out for dinner, going to a steakhouse. This is going to be nice. Do I chew it? No, you just leave. Like, open your mouth and just slides right down. If I don't like it. You'll turn it on until you try it. Go on, Bree. You're content right now. I like it, or else. It's already not bad. 
Bombs up. Like <laughs> that? It's like it's a little salty, isn't it? It's like I'm eating the sea. Like <laughs> see, easy three out of ten. I'm not eating another one. I don't make it. <laughs> It's not going out. <laughs> it's stuck in there, dude. Ooh. Oh man, it's like a three. It's like a three or a two, bro. You, you haven't eaten one, but what would you give out of ten? A zero. It looks like snot. Yeah. Like it looks terrible. I can't try it. No way. I like oysters. It does help a little bit. Yeah. What's your rating out of 10? Oh, I love oysters. So nine. give it out of 10. Nine. nine. Yeah. I'm with, that with brings me. it from a two to a five. No, two to a four. You're not supposed to chew it. You're supposed to swallow it in one go. And I'm going to pretend to like it. Get it down. All right, cheers. Cheers. Three, two, oh. Oh, Chewing it doesn't make it better. It's not bad. 8.7. You can have the rest of the thing. Oh, yeah. Louie, look at how. What are you rating out of 10? It's like pretty basic. I don't know. It's like, I'd rather have scallops, but. Hey, Tempo, do you want to hold my hand? Do you want to hold my hand? I'm confused. Do you want to hold my hand? Yes. Oh. Wait, this is hot. Ah, this is hot. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Oysters round two. Yes, sir. Yeah. This is how you stay young, huh? Yes. If you want young, glowing skin, eat bone marrow. Coffee is really good. It's London, bro. What's good? It's the coffee? Yeah, the the coffee's really good. That's a solid 9 out of 10. I'll give it like an 8. Very, yeah. very good. Okay. I'll give it like an 8.5. Okay. Like 9, maybe. Give, give coach front seat, is it? No one ever wants the front seat. Yeah, screw you ever getting the front seat. <laughs>